Good news, Summoners. Now when you play League of Legends, you can not only have a great time, but you can feel proud that you're helping mankind discover the secrets of the human mind. Riot's Jeffrey Lin explains some of the novel problems they're working with on an MSNBC special. After the changes to Tribunal and the Honor System, the data is showing that we're all being nicer to each other. Well, most of us. Over in Korea, where everyone is polite already, KT Rolster B handedly took down Azubu Blaze in a 3-0 victory for third place in OGN's The Champions Winter. KT is continuing to show that even new faces in Korea will be scary threats for the rest of the world in Season 3. The final LCS European teams are being decided this weekend. We look forward to the tears of joy as players realize their dreams of becoming professional League of Legends players all around the world. Unfortunately for the losers, the future remains uncertain. First among these losers and to step out of the race is the incorrectly named Team LOL Pro, who were eliminated by Dragonborns and Team Acer this morning. Marn announced Nian Tanso as a sub for their LCS NA team, although Nian will still be able to play with other teams in tournaments outside of LCS. Look forward to his play with Big Fat LP on Team Cutest of Cats in the coming weeks. After two players of Team Solo Mebdi were banned yesterday, the remaining players decided to part ways. On the other hand, after Meat Playground disbanded, some of the players reformed as Curse Academy to compete in IPL6 and prepare for Season 4, where some players are not allowed to play in Season 3 or not old, or, uh, old enough quite yet. To keep up with how the old, new, and reformed teams are going to be doing, there will be a number of places to see the team's personalities and gameplay. MLG officially announced LOL will be at Dallas, Ivy Law will be running a collegiate qualifier for IPL6, CGS Premier Series is kicking off on Monday, and for the information on all the other qualifiers for IPL6, check out IGN.com slash IPL or Leakpedia. But you won't be seeing these tournaments on, or teams streamed on Own3D anymore, as they will be officially switching to Twitch TV, YouTube, or some other sort of streaming partner that hasn't been announced quite yet. Ideally, they will have learned from the mistakes of Own3D and we can continue to grow as a community. This has been IGN Torch with your League of Legends Daily News.